and just to remind my good friend, the leader of the house, that there's just a little bit of debate out there that he promised to lay the free SHS bill for more than a month now. That is the immediate debate in this house. He's unable to lay the bill for us to debate. As for the debate out there, I'm sure the unemployed want to debate Dr. Baunia. The I mean, people clearing goods, paying 20 different taxes at the port, would like to debate him. So actually, actually, the people who really want to debate him are out there. They should debate the people of this, of this country. President Mahama is just one individual. Debate the millions of people who are struggling under the, the, the hands of President, uh, uh, Vice President, and then we'll get there. In any case, I am not aware that anybody has invited anybody to a debate and the person has decided not to come. And debate, as you and I know, is not a requirement for any election. Otherwise, if it was so, in 2016, your candidate would have uh, qualified because he declined to debate, yet the election went on. So debate, debate at, at, at all costs, but you have been advised. If you can actually advise your flag bearer, to just meet journalists, which are not 32 million people, to just talk to them, just few of the journalists, meet them and don't don't choreograph the don't cook the questions. Allow them to ask proper questions. You see how it will go.